Welcome to part 2 of the online treasure hunt game. So here we will continue. In the second part I am going to show you how we go further, how we give a complete you know, look of the game using animations. So let's get started. So we go to insert and then we go to shapes, insert shapes. Here we create, click on action button and then we draw the action button here and then we go to hyperlink to next slide and then we play sound, click on play sound, we select a sound, click sound and press ok and then we go to the slideshow mode cancel we go to the slideshow mode and then we, if we press there yes the click sound has come okay so now we have to go to rename the, the action button rename it as ne next slide and then go to insert and we click on shapes and here we go to call call outs and here we put it just place it above the button and here we write click on it click me also click me we click and then we go to themes go to preset select that and just place it click on font size font style font size increase it yes and then we adjust it according to the box adjust the box go to animation go to pulse click on pulse and yes the animation is added and we go to animation we could go to timing we click on at end of this slide till the end of this slide yes again we go to animation click on the play uh, button click on the button and click on animation and then we go to pulse again and here again we click on that animation pane go to end of slide press ok you need to go to timing and click on end of slide so now we can see this is the animation effect and now what we have to do is we start with previous click on start with previous yes so we click that and we are immediately directed to the next slide so now we go to the go to Click on insert, go to action, we select hyperlink to play sound, click and this will be hyperlink to this slide and click ok. Uh, click show all and we need to add a timer here. So for that we will go to shapes, uh, we will take this curvy rectangle and draw it over here uh, make it something like this shape shape fill i will select uh, i don't like this thing let the theme show first i will select this one go to shape effects preset select this go to soft edges and select this 50 point uh, go to level and select i think this will look good so i will select this and i will go to shape outline select the red and shape outline go to where and select this one and some i will make like this uh, this will look good i will right put 
आई विल टू मिनट्स आई विल राइट एट टू Make something like this. Press Control. One. Click Enter. And drag it over here. So we'll click on two. Go to Animation and to this more animation and click X disappear. Double click here. Go to Timings. Go to delay and type fifty nine seconds and select start with previous. Okay. And I'm just going to hide this. So I will write here one and add animation disappear. Timings with previous sixty fifty nine seconds. Click OK and we will click OK and click Show All. So we will click on Insert, go to Shapes and select this rectangle and draw it over the slide. we will click insert do shapes select this curvy box change the theme style to red and here we will write time up control o Select Berlin Sans FB Demi and increase the fonts. Sorry for time up. Click Insert Shapes. This box. Type here E X I T. Exit. Press Control A. Go to Home. Increase the font. Select this Berlin Sans FB Demi, and we'll go to format. Change this to something like this. Exit. Go to insert. Go to action. Go to hyperlink to and show. Place a click. So we'll click shift, shift, and group them. We will write, rename it as time up in selection pane. Uh, so let us check how uh, it works. Just increase. So we click here. Go to animation. Go to fly in, and select. Start after previous. Will one seconds delay. So our game is ready. We will play. We will just change the font to white. Our slide show. Click start. Click here. We have only. We click here. So we click wrong. We won. So we can click exit. And we can play again. Just we'll wait for one minute.
so our time is up so we can exit the game yeah so didn't you find it an interesting and of course not so very difficult to use the animations don't you think so it is not so difficult only thing we have to keep you know each time we enter a box we create something we have to rename it so that we remember that is the only thing and once we do animation for one particular object we can just uh, copy the animations and rename the box again so we have to each time we have to remember to rename it it is not so difficult i'm sure you can try this animations to create your own game so why wait just get started and start using these animations so that your children will definitely love it and they will enjoy they will participate and they will also get involved in the learning process so hey there thank you so much and wait for another game very soon